Okay, so I don't know if some of you have who have been on social media or have seen things like some certain new news um reports, but um it's actually about um my last video that I made. Uh, this is actually a major update from the whole incident with the character with um the boy um Quaden, and this is what I found out. Um, I find out that. He is an actor, an influencer, a model, extra, and everything. And uh, we find out that he's not actually nine. He's he's actually eighteen years old, and that the possibility of him making this whole thing up is pretty big. Now, I I, I want to believe that possibly that this is probably a fake profile that people made. That people just made this up for no reason. Um, but these are actual photos here. Um, one of them actually looks like um, like it's photoshopped. I don't know if you see right here, like this little, like the one with the like like straight in the middle on in the picture in the bottom um right, right there in the middle. It looks like he's holding holding like a gun or something or a pen. But and then right there is like photoshopped in there. But uh. I really hope this is a fake profile. I really hope so. Um, if not, that's it's it's very embarrassing to literally get all that support and all that money, and then all of a sudden there is a lot of um there is a lot of controversy about what the hell happened. Now, it's it's weird. Because it says that, you know, like, like people like Quaden is, you know, possibly a, <laughs> a, um, a possibly an actor. Now, um, there is a actual, um, response to the claims, um, which is weird. So... We have the video. We have like all different videos of like you know the fake profiles and everything. So here, here's what it is. My boy recently turned 18, and my children are in this pic. So now we know where people have gotten the idea that Quaden Bales is 18 when he is nine years old, at the eight at at. Like at the same age as my son, get your facts right before making your your opinions public. So that that that's what's going on right here. And like, there's many different posts stating that yeah, he is um he is nine years old. So even even there was a post on Facebook that if you guys let me put this right here. So let me. Put it right here with the windows. Boom. Um, let me just get that out of the way. Right there. And I'm going to zoom it in for you guys. All right. It was a post made by her by her Facebook right here. And I'm going to highlight that. This is what she says on her Facebook page right here. So I'm going to say this once and that's that. I've known about Quaden since before this shit blew up. Yes, he's nine. Oh no, it's actually um a friend before that. Excuse me, not his mother's. A friend of Quaden's. Dwarfism is not a joke. Is he a model or actor? Shit, so are so are a lot of kids. That doesn't mean shit. All the money in the world can't change a disability or the pain that comes from it. Not to mention the health struggles and pain that comes from such. I know this. His mother made the post because she was overwhelmed and enraged with the bullying. I understand her to the fullest. A lot of lot of y'all's average kids get bullied too, so you've been there. <clears throat> so then she did not expect it to blow up the way it did. Never did she ask for money. That being said, another fellow little person did reach out to him, which is a famous comedian. He wanted to turn Quaden's frown upside down and create the GoFundMe account to take the Australian boy to Disneyland. Now that was his doing. Now that was his doing. Excuse me. 
that came from his heart. Never did they never did they say they were broke. Never did they say never did they ask for this shit. They are indeed scam they are indeed scammers who were who have tried to take advantage of the situation and have made another GoFundMe account to make bullshit like this and scam just for just for the fucking likes and bullshit, but I'm vouching for this kid. If ignorance blinds y'all from the real issue, then that's a damn shame. Okay, so here's my thing about it. I'm going to put this up right here. I'm going to put this in a perspective. I really hope that this is not true. I really hope that, you know, the situation is real. I can't I can't say anything about it. Like I don't know specifically about it. Um Here's what bothers me, and this is the one line that bothers me. It's a, that, like there are indeed scammers that will make to go that will um, make take advantage of the situation. So the problem is there's possibly a scammer out there or scammers out there making or taking the um the kids uh disability into you know in, in, like as a weapon to get money and then using that to be able to get and create GoFundMe's and other stuff and take people's money which is extremely sad to to do now that's one side of me that wants to say that you know i do believe this um i do understand i really understand where it is but here's another point of this because there's been a response to it um there is that speculation that Quaden is actually 18 and it does have that um that those pages um I, I I don't know if I if I can believe that I really hope it's not true um if it is true that's very despicable um because the situation that was stated is real it's it's a real situation that shouldn't be taken lightly and you know at one point it, it, as I said it there is that one friend right here that is, you know, doing things like, oh, you know, this is real. This is, they're sticking up for them and that she knows them personally. But then there's these pages that are coming up with it. So with that, I'm really hoping that, you know, that it's just a scammer just making fun of this kid and taking advantage of it. Because I don't want to believe that this situation is fake. Because this is a very, very 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 you know important situation that people should talk about my thing is is that if this is a fake thing and that that you know that this was all planned from the beginning i would be very very upset like a lot of people so that, that that's just where i'm at about it um if anything just let me know about it let me know what you guys think about it i hope that as i said i hope that you know it's not like I hope that this is not true. I really hope that, you know, the video was meant to send awareness of what bullying is doing to children. Um, but if it's not, if it's just a scam to get money, I would be very, very, um, very, very upset about that. Uh, I think with a lot of people. All right. But, um, you know, this is your boy, Crazy Space 98 aka Nicholas Morales, founder of the HG community. And uh, thank you for watching. And we'll keep you updated about this situation.